I think Imola is uh, special not just for me because, uh, okay, I'm Italian, but I think it's special for everybody because I talk uh, with some guys, uh, very young guys, come here today to race in the Speed Series and everybody was enthusiastic about the track because uh, I think it's one of the last track, uh, real race track, you know, like Spa, like Silverstone, like Donington, uh, because uh, it's uh, up, down to the hill, uh, fast corner, slow corner, fast and slow part, you know. Imola is, uh, is very hard on brake. It was always hard on brake because you have a lot of hard brake down to the hill in Rivaza. And uh, I remember also in time in Formula One, we used to have a little bit more braking on the back of the car because, you know, down on the hill, you have to brake quite hard. I like to describe it more as sort of the Alton Park of, of Italy, really. So it's got a good variety of corners. The undulation is fantastic. It really gives it character. There's some really tricky corners out there, which which make it enjoyable to drive. Yeah, it's, it's a fantastic track. Very little room for error, but I always feel those types of circuit are, are the, the best ones to drive, really. There is here the first time when there was a big straight, you know, and I remember in the turbo era in Formula One, we arrived at the end of the Toza 360 case per hour, and uh, the Tamburello was very scary, I can, I can tell you, and especially when it was on the wet. And uh, now it's a little bit more simple because we have two chicane, but beautiful chicane, but still quite hard to drive. Yeah, I mean, a lot of it is how you use the curbs and it's got its own unique challenge, but it's a you know, fabulous circuit and wonderful atmosphere. Uh, you know, I love the track, so uh, hopefully we can come away with it still, still with a good feeling.